Well, the team at Above the Dirt is hoping that you can bring uh, your love of gardening to anyone who is looking to learn. They're actually holding classes and events for anyone wanting to grow plants themselves. Reporter L Bottom spending the morning out there at their store in J-Town. L, it looks beautiful in there. Good morning, Claudia. It is so beautiful inside Above the Dirt. I'm here with Paula Henson, the owner out here. Mm -hmm. And what do you guys specialize in? So we're plant people. <laughs> so plants and all the associated planty things. Um, house plants, bonsai, books, pots, dirt. In the spring, this is like a vegetable gardener's paradise oh. and landscaping. I cannot wait to come back out here in the spring and explore all of that. But it is the winter time, yes. but you can still mm -hmm. buy your plants. And I feel like a lot of people kind of get intimidated when you know picking out a plant and there's a lot of different plant parents out there too so talk a little bit about that well there's you know they talk about people that have a green thumb like yeah. they can keep everything then others are like I kill everything I have a brown thumb um, and then there's plants that people call easy and plants that people call difficult but I actually think it's more about like your plant parent style and yeah. matching with the right plant yeah. so are you somebody that wants to water something once a month and like thrives on neglect you know, like snake plants and ZZ plants, this is a black raven ZZ, they actually require a dry period. Okay. So like, please ignore them. They're gonna, <laughs> they're gonna love that. Um, and then you have other plants that, they, you know, they, they need watering every week and right. it's color. But to me, sometimes it's which comes first, the plant or the pot. Right. You know, like you find a really, like you wanna bring some color into your area, so get an amazing pot. You find a plant that fits in it, then learn about the plant. Yes. So as long as you know, so I'm an overwaterer. Mm -hmm. That's my plant parent bad trait. Yes. So I need plants that thrive on moisture. They need a lot of water. I actually don't have a snake plant in my house because I kill them. I water them too much. <laughs> so it's more about matching with the right plant than anything. Yes. And you have a couple different options here, like yeah. you mentioned. And is this like a little terrarium plant? It's actually, it's a moth ball. Interesting. Right? So this is for the actual black thumb. All you have to do is change out the distilled water. Um, you do that like every couple of weeks or so. It grows very, grows very slowly and it's just there to make you happy. It doesn't need any light whatsoever because they come from the bottom of the water. Thanks. And it's so funny sitting right next to a bonsai that must be watered every single day and oh, takes wow. a lot of care. Wow. Right? So it just, there is truly something for everyone. It's just a matter of knowing like when you purchase it, that you're purchasing a healthy plant um, and then talking to somebody to give you the information, you know? Right. Yeah. And um, you guys are hosting a lot of different holiday events and workshops yes. right here in the building, right? Yes, we love. So I actually come from a professional development background in the hairdressing industry. Wow. So right, <laughs> crazy enough, um, I like to teach adults things um, and we do that here at the shop as well. So whether it's a plant workshop um, or like we're bringing in Santa and we have kids uh, during that holiday break, we're going to do a bunch of stuff for like elementary and like the tween age is going to do terrariums. Um, oh, it's so much fun. Yeah. And where, what is your website so people can get those? tickets above the dirt garden shop everything will be there and if you want to make sure you don't miss anything throw us your email and as new things are announced we'll okay. make sure to let you know awesome well coming up next we're gonna explore a little bit more of the store back to you Claudia